Yo empecé a los siete años en el reciclaje. I began recycling when I was seven years old, like my mother and my grandmother before me. This work is our family tradition. For over 80 years, we recyclers have been an important part of the waste management solution in Colombia. But there was such contempt for recyclers that we were called disposables. Nora Padilla, a fiercely proud waste picker, became the spokesperson for the battle against Bogota's waste management system, which favored large companies who profit from the methane gas produced by garbage. When recyclers were denied access to landfills, they were forced to work in the streets. Gathering recyclables from the landfills was secure because we knew that we would be able to collect and sell. Being in the streets meant facing uncertainty and danger. That is why it was important for us to organize. The recyclers first formed a workers' union, which grew into the Bogota Recyclers Association. ARB represents some 3,000 grassroots recyclers under Nora's leadership. I never asked to be nominated. The people decided to vote for me because they saw me working alongside them for many years. We are both committed to this collective dream that we have built, to getting society to recognize our value as workers. ARB operates two recycling centers, where members can sort and sell materials, with plans to open the largest facility run by informal recyclers in Latin America. In me, como reciclador, pues genera convicción. As a recycler, this gives me conviction, because I not only earn my living from this work, but I also know that it benefits the environment. The main impact of our work is that millions of tons of recyclables are kept out of landfills, which will save millions of trees, liters of water, and barrels of petroleum. Nora and the ARB fought for the legal rights of recyclers, in a major victory, the courts mandated that recyclers could compete with private firms in bidding for waste management contracts. When we began the bidding process in Bogota, we had death threats. We were robbed and they stole our computers. The recyclers have made many sacrifices, including some who have given their lives in the defense of this noble work. Nora has successfully led contract negotiations with the city, guaranteeing recyclers comparable pay to city sanitation workers. Nora represents a fundamental connection between social justice and recycling's environmental objectives across Latin America. Thanks to the movement that the ARB is leading, we have achieved recognition and respect for our right to work. We are doing all of this to improve the recycler's standard of living. When you raise the living conditions for the recyclers, you improve all of society.